What up, Fight World? It's your boy, Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Interesting news. Looks like IBF champion Kel Brook is likely to face Diego Chavez October 24th. Now, the thing that's weird about this is there was an eliminator with Devin Alexander versus Diego Chavez that was already in place. An agreement was reached, which avoided the purse bid, but now... Diego Chavez, there's no need for him to fight an IBF eliminator with Devin Alexander if he's going to get the straight shot to Kell Brook and his belt. So, very interesting. It kind of leaves Devin Alexander high and dry, but he's coming off of a loss. So I'm sure there's other fights out there for Devin. But Diego Chavez, Kell Brook, definitely a step up from the last two opponents, everybody since Sean Porter. So, JoJo Dan, Frankie Gavin, Diego Chavez. He's better than his record shows. He has some losses. Some are unjust. I don't I don't like the disqualification with Brandon Rios. I had him clearly winning. I thought they were both doing dirty tactics. And I know a lot of people were on board for Brandon Rios versus Kell Brook. To me, this is a more intriguing fight because I think Diego Chavez has power. He was winning, like I said, against Rios. And I think he has more dynamics and more tools. Brandon Rios is very good on the inside, but... I don't think he's as dynamic. And Diego Chavez even pushed Keith Thurman into a tough fight and forced him to adapt. So we'll see how this goes. Again, I'm not going to complain too much because Diego Chavez is solid. Timothy Bradley has a draw with him. So I would. it's a barometer. Diego Chavez is tough. He has power. And it's a good barometer for anybody. This fight is going to take place most likely in Manchester October 24th. I will keep you guys updated. Let me know what you think of this matchup. Make sure you like my video as always. Hate, comment, and subscribe. Till next video is Ego signing off.